They're meant to provide healing and help through physical contact. That's what 4E Kennels is built on. Going out and, and helping people and in this time of so much anxiety with people and we can't send out our therapy dogs to help, um, you know, because of the risk of transmission. Jeanette Forey doesn't let anyone visit her dogs right now. I love to be able to meet people and hug people and see people and, and feel emotions directly with people. But with COVID-19, that's that's definitely given us some challenges. But she is still getting emails. This one from CCSD's crisis response team. They're the ones who come in when there's a traumatic event impacting a school. Can you guys hear me? She set up a video chat with them saying she just needed to ask a couple of questions. Who would be caring for the dog? The crisis team takes care of the entire school district. Nearly 400,000 people, students and staff. Teachers, your team. It would be a big job for one of these small pups. Oh, Joey lost you. After some freeze frames and dropped connections. Oh, oh my gosh, technical difficulties. <laughs> you got the Healing Heart recipient puppy. Congratulations, you guys. When this application came across, I knew immediately they were going to get a dog. 4E Kennels is donating a dog to a deserving team. Jeanette would know she's a former CCSD teacher herself. Look at that face. This is huge. We have not placed a dog that will truly be able to reach and help so many people at such a crucial time of grief and sadness and helping adolescents. Wow. Look at the little <laughs> I had envisioned being able to walk into the crisis response center with a puppy and uh, surprising him. So it was a little bit of a, a letdown initially, but it's still, I'll get that moment. We'll get that moment when, that, when the puppy is trained and I see the dog working at schools. You have eight weeks to get ready for a puppy. <laughs> Tiana Bonner, Fox 5 News, local Las Vegas.